Hi, I'm licensed Nevada Foreclosure Mediation Representative Damian Falcone, and this is part two of our revised Nevada Foreclosure Mediation Program video series. In part one, we spoke about the eligibility requirements, and today we will talk about the documentation that needs to be prepared in preparation for your mediation. In the next episode, we will talk about the lender documents, including examples from our files of some of the errors you should look out for. This is Get Modified, the go-to source for loan modification and foreclosure prevention information. For more information, go to www.falcongreditmanagement.com. Within 10 days of your election and receipt of the fees, the state will appoint a mediator for your mediation. And that mediator should send you notice of their appointment. The mediator should schedule your mediation within 90 days and schedule a document conference as soon as possible. During the document conference, you will discuss what documents you will be exchanging, and the lender will provide this request in writing within five days. The documents you submit will be the most important items in achieving the deal you want. Our Falcon Box software populates our documents efficiently, saving us from entering the same information in many different places. If you're doing these documents by hand, you'll likely be preparing the following forms. The Form 710 Uniform Borrower Assistance, their RMA or Request for Modification Agreement, the 4506 T form, the Dodd Frank, our Financial Hardship Memorandum, including Proposal for Resolution, the Borrower Financial Statement. Out of the six documents we listed, there are a total of 699 fields of information. This is actually only 173 fields of data that are duplicated throughout the documents. Our Falcom Doc software is able to populate these six documents, 699 fields, and more than 60 calculations after you enter only 113 fields. We actually use 27 documents in our average application. We also offer downloadable PDF versions of these documents at our website, so you can have a nice printed copy that is easy to read rather than a handwritten one. And they also will save you a great deal of time if you should have to make an edit or resubmit. The Nevada Foreclosure Mediation Program does not penalize homeowners for not supplying the required documents as it does the lenders. But the lender is permitted to deny a modification or other workout option due to an incomplete or missing document. If you are going to mediation to get a deal, we recommend you complete all your documents and be prepared to supply them more than once. In part three, we will talk about the required lender documents leading up to and including the mediation. I'm Damian Falcone, and this is Get Modified.